today we're going to make some colour mixing spinners. Here is what you need, a half an old cereal box, a pencil, some colours, blue, red and yellow, and a pair of scissors, and a cup, or something round to draw around. So first of all, on the inside of the cereal box, you want to draw around your circle three times. Then get some scissors and cut out your three circles. You can see here that I'm cutting um, a larger piece out first to make it easier for my cutting. And remember, when you cut, move the cardboard or the paper around, not your scissors. As you can see, I'm moving the scissors, um, but I'm moving the cardboard around. Okay. Then you want to draw a line down the middle of each circle. And you're going to use red, blue and yellow and you're going to have two colours on each circle. So this first one here I'm colouring half yellow and half blue. So I've got blue and yellow. Now I'm going to colour yellow and I'm going to colour red. You, I'm using crayons, you could use crayons, you could use oil pastels, you could use markers, you can use paint. You could even get coloured pieces of paper if you don't have anything to colour or paint with. And then your last one will be blue and red. So you can see I'm colouring really carefully. The thicker my colour, the better it will be. Okay, so when you have your three circles, you can see each of them here now, you are going to need to make a hole in the middle of each circle. You might, well you probably will need an adult to help you with this. So I'm going to find the middle of my circle, I'm going to get something, oh, so I'm going to draw where I think the middle is. I could try and be really specific, but just guess roughly the middle, it doesn't matter too much. Then you can use something that's sharp. So you've got, I've got different types of pencils here. I also have a skewer. You could even try it with a small um, stick. And get the sharp bit, put something soft underneath. I've got a notepad there. And just push the pencil through. Um, and do that on all three. So if you're just using one pencil, you can use the same pencil on each spinner. Then just switch your pencil each time. And that's what you're going to do when you've got your pencil in there you are going to spin it now this bit's a bit tricky but I'm hoping you can see when you spin it the colors mix together another way to do it as you can see I put my hand around the top to make a circle I'm going to spin it inside and hopefully you can see that when you mix blue and red it makes purple when you mix yellow and red it makes orange that's one's a bit easier to see there you go, you can see the orange, and hopefully you can see when you mix blue and yellow, it makes green. Have fun, enjoy making your spinners, and when you've done them, I'd love you to take a video of you trying to spin your spinners and put that on C.